in this guide, I'll show you how to fix it when your game voice chat and mic's not working in Call of Duty Black Ops 6 on the Xbox One or Xbox Series S or X. So from the home menu, press start on your controller and scroll on over to channels. And you want to ensure that you're in the game channel. So to connect to it, press on the right trigger and it'll bring you back in if you weren't connected. Then what you want to do is scroll on over to settings and we're going to go to audio settings. Now that'll bring you to this page where you want to ensure that the master game volume's turned up. If you're using a headset and mic, also ensure that the volume dial's turned up. And for the global audio mix, select the one for your specific setup. Now once you've done that, we're going to press RB on the controller to go over to voice chat and ensure the voice chat volume's turned up here and voice chat's turned on. Now for proximity chat and last words voice chat, this is just going to be personal preference. You can leave these on or off. And for the game voice channel, you want to ensure that this is on all lobbies so you can hear other people chat in game. Now, once you've done that under voice chat output device, we're going to change this to headset if you're using a headset and use speakers if you want the TV speakers to put out the voice chat. So once you've done that, go to microphone and ensure microphone levels turned up here and you're able to test your microphone in game. So you'll notice I'm currently talking into my microphone with my headset and there's no movement. So no worries, press the X button on your controller. We're going to scroll down and we're going to go to audio and music. And you want to ensure headset mic is turned on here. Now, if you still don't see any movement in game for your microphone, if you're using a headset, make sure that you haven't accidentally toggled the mute feature on it. A lot of headphones do have a mute toggle, so ensure that's not on. And ensure your volume dial is turned up. Now you want to ensure headset volumes turned up as well here for the headset chat mixer. Leave it somewhere in the middle. And mic monitoring, this is to test your actual microphone, but you can turn it down. Now if it's still not working in game, now we're actually going to go to the home menu. And we're going to go to settings in the top right. Then once you're here, scroll on over from general and we're going to go to volume and audio output. Now it should by default, when you plug your headset into your controller, it should automatically switch to headset format, but if not, Ensure you select that if you're using a headset and mic, or if you're just using your TV speakers for the audio, you can leave it on stereo uncompressed. Now, once you've done that for headset format, Windows Sonic for headphones or stereo uncompressed is gonna be just fine. And if it's still not working, go back here. I also recommend you go to devices and connections, controllers and headsets. Then you wanna go to these three dots underneath your controller and ensure your controller's up to date. Now I'm using a third party, so I can't update this controller, but if you're using an official Xbox one, there'll be an option to update your controller here, which can fix issues with your headset and your controller working properly. Now, if you go in game and it's still not working at this point, what I recommend you do is swap out your headset and microphone and controller to see if it's a hardware issue. 